Hey y'all, what's up? This is Keisha and I am back with a swag haul from Go Wild 2019. If you don't know, Go Wild is an epic planner conference. If you want to know more about it or just see like what was going on, I did film a vlog every day. It's on my vlog channel, which is Keisha Glam. I'll have it linked below. So let's go ahead and get into this because usually these videos are pretty long. So I'm going to go through them really quick. If I have anything to add, I will. But the first one is from Plan Your Spoons on Etsy. I'm sorry if there is a coupon code that I'm like showing to the entire world. I'm sorry. <laughs> so um, again, this is Plain Your Spoons, and this sheet is dedicated to, um, like, chronic illnesses and disability, so she has a very unique shop. Next up is Joyful Planner. This is a full, well, yeah, like a full sheet, basically. Adriana Piper. Azalea City Planning. Jameson Reed. These are adorable. We have two, three from... Peony paper, if that's how you say it. I've never had to pronounce the word peonies, but she obviously has some adorable girls in her shop. Say So Co. And what I love about this is that she actually, you know, tells you how to pronounce it right there. Say So Co. So that's really neat. Birds Fly Studios. She actually um did like a spotlight swag in the hallway. She had a pin of her character Callie. I think that's her name. Planning with Jazz, Lily's Little Cupboard, or Cupboard, Cupboard, I think that's how they say it. <laughs> Some full overlay boxes by Rose Colored Days, and these are really pretty. Moonshine Sticker Co. These are... Let's see. Yes, they are overlay headers or transparent headers, however you want to say it. These are from Create Creativity and in Ink. Scarlet Lawn Planner Society. These, they're probably getting a little washed out, but they're like an iridescent green. Little Red Balloon Ink. Shine Sticker Studio, which is actually one of my favorite shops. How freaking cute is Luna? I love that, you know, it. I love the theme of it. I just love Luna period honestly I like that there's multiple skin tones on this sheet and there's star and this is just so cute and look at it look at the shape of this parasol paper I want to say yes I didn't even know the name of it and I just assumed it y'all I love their stuff it's so cute and um I actually met these two there's two sisters yeah um I met them and they're so awesome y'all I met them at the happy planner event which I'll talk more about later this is Addie Bell & Co. And I like the way this paper feels. It feels like a vinyl on the back. It's not exactly what you would call like the premium matte vinyl. It's somewhere in between. So it's a nice, a nice paper. Let's make sure. I feel like it's slightly washed out. So let's lower this just a little bit. Okay, let's see how that helps. Um, next up we have Dolce Planner. Or Dolce Planner. This is This Very Crafty Mama. I love the shop owner, Jessica. We talk a lot. Love her so much. I don't know how to pronounce this, but it's Win It Studio or Win It. I don't know. I'm sorry. MP Designs Co. I also really like the shop owner. And yeah, there's, there's a sticker gone, which it honestly looks like. No, I was going to say it looks like it could have been the Go Wild logo, but maybe not. I do believe my memory card was full there for a second because um, all the Go Wild blocks are still in this memory card because I'm still editing those videos. So again, this is MP Designs Co. And I did go through the stickers for once. Like, I've never gone through them first, but I figured it'd make the video go faster if I'd already seen some of them. But I didn't notice how cute these were, and I really love that just like Luna, which is Shine Sticker Studio right here. I love when, like, the person is, like, neutral, like, their clothes are neutral, but their hair is rainbow. So, I really love that this little character is white with rainbow hair. That's adorable, y'all. I will definitely, um, this is my first time seeing her character. I thought she was mostly a kid shop, but these are really cute. Wild Summer Designs. This is Sticky Situations Co. And her sheet is a little big. I'll try to zoom out just a smidgen. There we go. 
Oh, that's cute. That's really cute. Sticky Situations Co. And this is... Now, this paper feels different. I'm going to say that this is actual vinyl. Maybe. It's really soft, though. Um, it feels like you'd be able to write with any pen on it. It feels cool. And this is Sugar Lemon Paper Co. That's a cute name. Alright, so that is the first bit of the what was in the swag bag. I do have separate videos um, for different things. My brother's in there watching the football. Not football. Basketball. Um, apparently the playoffs or the championships or something are going on. So, um... I do have separate videos depending on what it is, but this will be mostly the swag bag, so I did separate some things. So next up we have Adorably Amy Designs, and I actually ordered from her, um, I ordered from her a few times, I think. I had patience, I had my patience tested, it's negative. <laughs> I like that a lot. This one's super cute, and it is Hello Muffin Shop. I love this. This one is, feels like a vinyl on top. I like it. I like it a lot. It seems like you may need to use a Sharpie on it. It's really nice though. I like it. And then I put some smaller ones in this bag. Alright, let's zoom in a smidgen more. Alright, so first up we have Planner Bunny Press. I didn't even have to look at the name this time, y'all. So, um, she actually gave one of these fold-over boxes in um, the... La yeah last year's swag bag and I thought it was so cool so I see she came back with another one so that's really nice this is one of those foldable ones where you can like hide the information on one of the boxes or something so she donated two so there's this one and then there is this one and it says not sure what to do make a bookmark so that's really cool that she like explains um and then she gives all the characters names here so this is really nice I like this I like when like the sticker sheet is shaped like a die cut of an image or whatever <laughs> um oh this one's cute i don't remember seeing this one triple threat planner fully foil and it seems to have like a bunch of um like tv shows or something there's phantom of the opera west side story mean girl so this is really cool and it's obviously super foiled we have starfish and frog which is also um the same owner of miscellany boulevard this is so, and her paper is like really soft. And the colors are so pretty. I love it that they're like in between colors. Like it's a soft watermelon pink, a soft light teal. I like this a lot. X, X, wait, XO. <laughs> I can't talk. XO, XO, glitter and glam. I remember her sheet from the swag bag last year and it was so cute. But if I'm not mistaken, whenever I went to order from her, she maybe was closed or so. I'm picking up the stickers because I do that when I... I'm holding my own sticker sheet, so sorry, I can't help it. <laughs> Bella Rose Paper Co. And apparently she also has Hobonichi stickers available. The Crafty Banana. This is a glossy sticker sheet, as you can tell, with some Vegas stuff. So there's a tiny scene. That's cool. And then a full box. Simple Southern Mommy. And all of her, well, all the stickers I've seen from her are shaped like jars. Planner bomb. Her stuff is always super cute. I thought this was a blank sticker, but it's not. This is Rose Paper Party. And this little box says, Cuddle a Bull. Oh, like a bulldog or a pit bull. I, whatever, I can't talk. Okay, so this isn't a missing sticker. This is an overlay. A simple but adorable overlay nice I am like so grateful that some of the shop owners like foiled stuff like not because I just love foil but because I know the work that goes behind it so like I appreciate them so much sticker guru laughter is timeless imagination has no age and dreams are forever Walt Disney that's nice pop co which is formerly pretty on paper co I can't I'm busy not really it always seems impossible until it's done. Today sucks. Living that planner girl life. Okay. I like this one. Ooh, this one's so pretty, y'all. It's so pretty in person. This is Pink Popsicle Studio. And I've... Oh, she's been on my order list. I won't even admit. I was watching, I think, Manda Phenom or Phenom um, on YouTube. 
back in 2015 and I saw she was using this shop. I do think it was the shop that she was using and I've been meaning to order from this shop forever and I think seeing the swag now is like the push I need to go order finally. So that's why like um, I try to tell people or other shop owners who feel like they should give up like I think the average person has to see your, see your shop or see an item for like what, 8 to 12 times? It may be like 18 times. I'm not sure, but either way, it is a lot before they actually decide to purchase. And some people aren't like that, but I know me, I am definitely like that. I have to see things a million times before I finally purchase it, unless it's like something Akatar related, which is A Court of Thorn and Roses, which is my favorite book. But anyways, let's keep going because I can go on and on about Akatar. I loved this. I shared this on Instagram. It's Organized Magic. Um, I joined her shop group recently and she does like random carpools for her group and it's really cool that I think that she, you know, is sticking to her theme of her shop so that's pretty cool. I love when someone's genuine towards their shop. Cupcakes and stickies. I met her in line last year but I don't think I'm, I don't think I saw her this year. Sweet Bean Plans. I've never ordered from this shop, but I think I really like her logo, I think. Like, we always end up in, like, a Instagram loop or something together, and I like her logo. <laughs> Vividly Rainy or Vividly Ronnie. I don't know if I met the shop owner in a while, but I definitely, like, know of her. My Little Chickadee Co. I love this shop so much, and this is another shop. Whenever I go to order, she's closed. Or it's just always something. I don't know, but I love the shop. This may be my third piece of swag from them so far, and I just, I just, I don't know. I just like it. I love their style. This is a people group. I went to Las Vegas, and all I got was an amazing time. Oh, this is Jackie Plans. I adore Jackie. All of a sudden, it's decided that it isn't going to, like, focus for me whenever I ask it to. That's not very nice, camera. There we go. Sassy Apple Studio. You know you want to focus. There we go. Lexi Kylie Designs. Since I'm like taking the bullet here by um, showing y'all the coupons, use them. Show these shop owners some love, please. <laughs> Britannia Nicole. And then lastly, or what I think is, well, lastly of the sampler sheets that I haven't taken out of their packaging yet, took out of their packaging, this is Gabriella Inez, I think that's how you say it. I remember her shop from um, the swag in the previous years. So, um, these are all the separate sheets. I did not take out um, some other sheets out of their packaging because there was so much and I didn't want it to get lost. So. We are going to open up some, and by the way, while I open some of these up, um, you had the option of doing a quarter swag, or half swag, or full swag, so there may be some sheets that I have that other people didn't get, and vice versa, so just keep that in mind, and then also, y'all can imagine that this is a lot of stuff to organize, so I may have, you know, like, one may have flew under the couch, or maybe it's still in the suitcase, or maybe it's mixed in with other swag, so just bear that in mind that there is, like, a lot going on here, and this is still just sticker sheets. I haven't gotten to pins or, um, like, the corporate sponsor stuff, or, like, the swag drops, or the washi. This is just the sticker sheets so far. Oh, I wanted to show y'all that. How cute is this? This is Planning Boss, and they, like... I don't know what you call thread it sewed um it's shut so I thought this was like a really cute and unique way to package it so now that you've seen it I can now rip it because <laughs> I've been waiting to rip it okay let's see where to start let's start here with SLO planning it could be slow planning but I'm not entirely sure so these are really cute I would love these I don't drink coffee but I would love these if I did decide to have tea which probably won't but I do drink hot chocolate, so I would probably save these for the winter time. There's some check marks, and I love her foil. It's very vivid. I like it. And then there is a little vinyl decal. I think that's what they call these. <laughs> a vinyl decal, so that's S-L-O planning. Next up, we have 
planning boss if you see my nails looking kind of dark they're not dirty okay I promise I had black nail polish on for two weeks so my nails are kind of tinted black underneath this gorgeous purple so planning block bloss planning boss um, donated three sticker sheets thank you planning boss thank you to everybody like y'all are awesome I had a mix up with mine so I ended up um, creating 1400 sticker sheets in less than a week on top of doing the sponsorship and other things so swag is fun swag takes a really long time and I'm so grateful to all the other shop owners who dedicate their time and resources to donating to go wild and making the experience even better this is mess of goodies and there's also a bow die cut as well as a little oh I love this I always see this color vinyl on Instagram but I never um, never seen it in person I don't know if I can capture the true color or not because it's only showing up blue I oh almost almost <laughs> but it's it's really pretty y'all so that was mess of goodies next up is imagine that by Lori I do believe um I ended up taking it out of the package but if I remember correctly it is imagine that by Lori over here we have um let's see aha this is Highland Bell plans and Highland Bell studio okay Planner friends make the best friends. This is so nice and inclusive. I, I love shop owners who think about the people that represent the community, you know? I love inclusive shops. I really do. So this is just a little, I guess you can use it as a die cut as you want, but it's more so informational. And this is a big old die cut. That's really awesome. And again, that shop is Highland Bell Plans. Next up, and I want to say that this was a separate swag drop and it wasn't in the swag bag. So this is Bubble Bear Studios. And I've never shopped with this shop, but apparently the stuff is really cute because look at it. So just some die cuts and it looks like a sticker sheet. This is super adorable, right? This is a sticker sheet. Yes. Again, I love die cut shaped stickers. Super cute. And then there is a rainbow. And this rainbow looks to be a very glossy sticker. It's very durable, so it's definitely a decal, I think, because it's pretty durable. So that's Bubba Bear Studios. Next up, oh gosh, I hope I don't go on a long tangent about this one, y'all. Alright, so you know how I mentioned Akatar being my favorite book? I could have freaking cried when I saw this quote. It's actually from Akamath, I do believe. Akamath is part two of like a 3.5 book series it says to the stars who listen and the dreams that are answered I have this in my Instagram bio I have an entire rings to yen set up an Akatar theme it's so gorgeous like I really hope that I can capture it uh, it's not showing as pretty as it is in person but y'all it is gorgeous I've ordered from her before and I have this quote I think in several different formats but um I guess I went so nuts over it on Instagram that she told me that she's going to be bringing more Akatar stuff to the shop and I'm going to be the first in line because I cannot get enough of it it's definitely my favorite book or my favorite book series so that's the Prince and Doxy by the way and this is the sticker sheet that she sent and this is just an informational card. You can find her the Prancy Doxy on Prancy Doxy on Instagram. And I had seen her shop around for a while, especially because I um, owned a Doxin when I joined the planner community. But I just never stopped in her shop, and Akatar brought me there. <laughs> Next up is Kindred. Well, yeah, Kindred stamps slash Kindred stickers. So these are some. Harry Potter characters. That's another reason why I want to take them out of the package because um, I'm not using soft lighting. I'm using a ring light right now. So, yeah, you see that glare happening there. And then these are stamps. Go Wild Kindred stamps. There is a Go Wild logo, y'all. Yes. I don't know how to stamp, but I'm going to figure it out for this logo. There's a bow. That's some pretty useful stuff here. I like it. I like it. Next up, we have KPO Plans, and this was also, I want to say, a separate swag drop, which means that it was not in the swag bag. It was brought out um, separately at some point. Hey, girl, do your thing. And it has a girl. This is a nice keychain. 
This is like a very durable sticker again. It says yay. KPO plans, in case you, you know, you don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> um, a little foil sheet with tons of foil doodle goodies. I love it. I love it. I've also never ordered from her shop before. You are always enough and never too much. Amen. I saw this and fell in love. This is going to look gorgeous on my Instagram, which I do have like a planner slash shop Instagram, which is at kglamco. But a lot of you don't know that I have a personal Instagram that is filled with things that I love and lots of color because I love color and seeing color makes me happy. So my personal Instagram, which you're welcome to follow, is at Keisha Glam. Just going to throw that out there but I'll have everything linked below of course because that's what youtubers do we link shit below this is a postcard from let's make it sparkle it says good vibes ahead with let's make it sparkle on the back I'm really loving these now that I'm a TN gal and then we have instead of tripping I'm sipping <laughs> I love her she's so cute and like all her stuff is so adorable um, she is Let's Make It Sparkle on Instagram and I think YouTube as well, but Natalie is just so awesome and she's, she lives a good life, I think, like, I, I think she lives a good life, like, I, when I watch her, I don't really watch Plan With Me's anymore right now because I've been so busy, but I'm hoping to get back in them. I always thought that, like, she lived, like, the best weeks, like, I thought her weeks were always, like, fun and amazing. Oh, look at this gorgeous foil, like, y'all are gonna turn me into a foil queen. Love it. And there's freaking bows on everything. Can we just... So cute. I'm trying not to miss anything. We have plan to design. A flower blossoms for its own joy. I love that. It's not blossoming for you. It's blossoming for its own freaking joy. That is a hella long checklist. That's six little lotus flowers. I think that's a lotus. I'm not sure. Plan to design. And then there's also a... Um... What do we even call this? This is a poker chip. I went wild with plan to design. Nice. There is a little paper clip here. Wild and free. This is a die cut from plan to design. And then also custom stickers for all of your planner needs. Plan to design on Instagram. Creating & Co. Creating & Co. is actually a shop owner that I began to sort of know, I guess, if you will, from um, her and Chrissy's podcast. I don't know if, I don't think they do it anymore, but the podcast was Confessions of a Girl Boss, and I would listen to it faithfully. So I got to know Paige through there. I found out she loved books, um, and I started going through a really rough patch in my life, and I think, I want to say that Paige kind of reminded me how awesome books are, and because... Within the past couple of years, I stopped reading and just hearing her talk about books just got me back into books and now I read all the time again and I just love it. So I feel like I have that slight connection with Paige. Um, a lot of her stuff is book related, so that's pretty awesome. So she included a sticky pocket. This is a washi tape, um, like die cut or bookmark, whatever, but let me see if I can make it focus. Do you see how there's little books there? She actually has washi that has books on it. So, like, can we just? So, this is, uh, I guess, like a replica of her washi. And I don't know if she still sells it. But if she does, I need it. Because I know it came in several different colors. This says, live a creative life. And it kind of, it reminds me of her logo. So, maybe that's on purpose. And, let's see. Whoa, you included all the links. You go, girl. All of them. Um, Creating & Co. on Instagram, Facebook group there's her youtube i'm not sure if she has two channels or not i think she may i'm not entirely sure but she definitely um plans she does book stuff she even has a book instagram she's pretty awesome just like check her out because i really adore Paige. and these are her stickers this is exo her doggy <laughs> i know so much about this girl <laughs> Um, I think I like tagged her or something and she was like, oh, I didn't realize that you knew me. And I'm like, girl, I know your dog. I know your, um, I know, I think his name is Cody. I know that he cuts the stickers or something or another. I know everything about you, girl. <laughs> I just like silently stalk, stalk from a distance, I guess. But I realized, um, I found them through the podcast. So after that, I realized that her and Christy, Chrissy were pretty cool. So. 
yeah I guess that's when the stalking started <laughs> okay so oh wait there's a little bit more over here there's actually more but I was trying to do all the sticker stuff so this is SK illustrations oh she did um go wild merch I think because I remember seeing the shop that's really cute I'm like oh my gosh digital artists and just any artist y'all are so talented so talented so next I'm gonna go through some of the insert books that we got so first up is PT paper and this is habits this is cool oh monthly habits okay girl I don't know what size this is but this is pretty cool and good paper quality I'm gonna say yes great paper next up is paper penguin co and this is a dot grid nice 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 and then one of my favorite insert shops when I buy them physically is lights planner action and this is just a wild sampler um just showing you kind of like what she has so you can fill her paper and stuff it's really nice this is like a password website tracker a daily um list or daily you know that thing this is really awesome i actually have been intending to buy this insert i think it's fairly new but i love it because that's how i like to shop um i prefer to make my grocery list and then make it again so to save me on making it again I can just use one of these inserts meal planning Ooh, this is her weekly layout I wish I could zoom out more but I don't think I can horizontal grid undated she does have undated which I love I use all well all of my inserts from her are undated I'm an undated girl because I use a personal, sometimes I use an EC, and sometimes I use my YPH. So, I need for it all to be undated, which reminds me, I just bought an Erin Condren, y'all. And it's dated. Oh, my God. I'm going to have to, like, redate. And then there's a calendar on every page. Like, I'm just having a moment right now. Because I'm like, why didn't, what was stopping me? It's dated. Oh, I was supposed to get an undated planner. We'll, we'll work it out <laughs> weekly overview <laughs> over here and then this is another daily one I used um, I have this as an insert and then I have it as a notepad form um this looks like I'm not even sure like what oh oh this must be like a monthly tracker of some I don't know I don't know y'all it's getting pretty warm so I'm starting to like lose it here a reading log <laughs> oh this is cute look at that down there that's really nice Oh, and a book, like a book tracker thing, and then a monthly tracker. So that's Lights, Planner, Action, and look at this. One of the Go Wild theme songs is Wild Ones by, I don't Flo Rider and Sia. Um, I think it's Sia. Look at this. Hey, I heard you were a wild one. Oh, boy. Like, I love this so freaking much. And then she has all of her sizes and stuff down here. So that's Lights, Planner, Action. Her stuff is awesome. I love her paper. Okay, and then I have all of these. I'm not entirely sure, so I'm just going to go through them really quick. This one is from Paper Penguin Co., which was one of the inserts I just showed you. It says, if I cannot do great things, I can do small things in a great way. I love that. This is Llama Love, and it is from Planners and PJs. They did go wild merch as well. This is a $10 free code from Paper House. This is Miss Moss. Come on, y'all. She is, they are just so adorable. She um created a showgirl version, I think. Yeah, showgirl version for Vegas. And this is so vivid and so pretty. So that's Miss Moss. This is Gucci Project. I plan to, but how cute is that squirrel? The Planner's World. Oh, I love this shop. Shaylin Paper Co. This was, um, I ordered from her for Go Wild for the first time, and I just loved it so much. I actually didn't end up using these stickers, but I decided I'm going to do, like, a two-week back plan using Go Wild kits. I don't really back plan, but I want to use those kits, so I'm going to do it just because, you know, the week before and the week of Go Wild were pretty eventful, so I want to do that. Oh, they are so cute, and I love their hair. 
I love their hair. I have a problema from Sugar Gal Shop. Planner friends make the best friends. Look at that cute llama. I love when llamas have lashes. This is from Small Town Grace. Cool. This is really cute. Um, and then this one is kind of big, so I may not be able to show the whole thing unless I zoom all the way out. Okay, there we go. Um, when I pray, my urge to smack people becomes less. And this is um, from Kinley at Plan to Blossom. This this girl's makeup is flawless. Her curls are popping. And there's a scripture down there. Plan to Blossom on Instagram. And this is a coupon from Bloom Bloom Daily Planners. Um, we were actually on the panel to get to. <laughs> I can't talk because I got so excited. We were actually on the panel together. Um, it was like a girl boss panel um, at Go Wild, and we were first up, and it was awesome. But I actually got a chance to, of course, spend a little bit of time with them. They're pretty awesome. They actually gave a planner and I think a sticker sheet. But since I have this here, we'll just talk about this. Okay, and let's move on into I think non-sticker items. This is Naomi Love Designs. She is a black shop owner. Just going to throw that out there in case you like to shop with brown or black shop owners. Just going to toss that out there. This is a washi card from Washi You Doing. And there's a little scratch off sticker there. I'll have to scratch that off and see what's underneath there. And then um, what I like is that in the Go On group, someone always creates like a coupon spreadsheet with the expiration date. So I love that. So you can always refer back to that. Uh, let's see, what is this? Scenic Serenity. I love her vellum. She has a lot of Akatar and like Zodiac and just check her out. She has a lot of good vellum and stuff um, for your TN or your ring bound. And this is Scenic Serenity again. I like this. That's really nice. Stay wild, my friend. This is from Blue Scooter Press with the mascot. This little guy is, or this little girl, sorry Loretta, I gendered you wrong. Or who knows, she could be binary, non-binary. Um, who knows? But its name is Loretta. Loretta's on the loose. She just left Vegas and has found her way onto vehicles and planners everywhere. Can you spot her? Loretta goes wild. And based off of this little wing, I can assume that this is Planner Fairy. It is. So that's really cool. Alright. And it looks like I'm no longer surrounded by a heap ton of stuff. So. I am going to go ahead and move into washi and something else that's pretty cool. I'm considering taking off, no it doesn't look like I'll need to. So the first washi is from Cookie Sticker Co and oh gosh, I don't even know how to say your name and I love you to death. Arian? I'm sorry girl if you're watching this. I still love you. <laughs> um, but she specializes in washi. And this is her washi. Please show up right, please. For me, let's see, how can I? I'm trying to see if I can like cast a shadow over what is. Is that it? No, that's not it. Is this it? Okay, I kind of cast it a slight, a slight shadow. So it's showgirls and foil stars. I hope this shows up pretty enough so y'all can see just how gorgeous it is. This next one is from Cricut Paper Co. She is a sticker slash washi slash albums and she's just doing it all y'all. This is like a confetti washi. We have one from, we have two from Pink Room Co. And they um, donated to the last swag bag. So this one is like a... Um, what am I trying to say? <laughs> this one's a multicolor rainbow and star. Star. I won't say it's foil entirely, but it's definitely kind of like shiny. I don't know if it'll look different when I take it out of the package or not. And this is the other one. It has like a little bow with hearts and things. They're like pretty skinny. Well, I think one of them is skinnier than the other. I'm not sure. Alright, and then... This is from, well, this is Senorita Margarita Lip Balm from Lisa V Creations. Um, <clears throat> she does create um, stickers for essential oil labels and regular stickers, I think. But I use her lip balm every day of Go Wild this year. Her lip balm in the tube is so 
awesome, y'all. And so this is organic lip balm. It has coconut oil, beeswax, shea butter, matcha green. I think you call it matcha. Matcha green tea, essential oils, lemon and lime. And just like last year, y'all, this stuff is amazing. Although I do think I prefer it in a tube. This may be like a sample. But, oh gosh. I I love it. And I need to order some more of her lip balm in the tube. This is from the Mika at Capital Chic Designs. And this says the fake planners of Go Wild. And, um, well, I think that's season four there because it's year four. Um, let's see if I can do a quick story time. Um, the Mika was saying that she is sometimes a fake planner. Like, she doesn't use her planner at all. She just does, like, lists or something. So, it's like an inside joke, sort of, so. The fake planners of Go Wild. And then, drum roll please, this is the Go Wild exclusive for right now, I think. It's exclusive for right now. Simply Gilded Washi. It does match the washi she gave last year. I think I saw someone make it match. I actually don't have... Oh, there it is. Yes. Oh, there's like stuff. Okay, there we go. Okay, so... That is, this is the one from last year, this is the one from this year, so like how cool is it that, yeah. I remember her saying she was going to bring out a big one, so I'm really hype about this set. Um, she also gave two more washi, but I will have to find them. They may be in a separate video, we will just see, because I don't know if I'm going to, depending on the length of this one, I don't know if I am going to do the corporate sponsors in this video or not. I don't think I will actually. <laughs> I actually just grabbed a heap ton of stuff off of my bed that was behind me and I realized that there's still a little bit of swag stuff mixed in so I will keep going for a little bit longer and we'll just see where this ends shall we. Y'all I swear to you that these two stickers were here before I put them on my bed like an hour ago. Just gonna throw that out there. So I mentioned um how there was a panel well y'all I Y'all, I swear to you, these two stickers were here like an hour ago. <laughs> There's no telling because some things got mixed around on the bed and who knows. My covers may have snatched some stickers off. Um, but I mentioned how there were separate swag drops and there were also um, different, just different drops and different ways to pick up swag. So this was actually the panel drop from the panel I was on. So these are some of the stickers from B Bloom Planners, and they do actually make a planner, by the way. But these are just some of the stickers that they have in their shop or in their store, I guess I will say. And then also, either this was in swag or it was a part of the swag drop, I really can't remember. Um, this is their planner. It's the 2019 through 2020 planner. I've never seen this before, so let's go through it just really quickly. Okay, yearly overview on the cover, important dates, that's pretty cool. There's a letter from the founders over here, I like that. Uh, let's see, so we have some goal tracking here, the definition of bloom up there. There's like an acronym for bloom. Okay, this is cool, more and less, I really like this. Weekly scheduling template, use these pages to track reoccurring events classes work schedules or plan out your ideal week okay this is cool well, there's a few of them okay we have some note pages here and then you can see that it is a horizontal lined planner i don't know if they have multiple types but this one is horizontal lined let's see and there's a calendar every day okay and then there's monthly sections with a quote up top here it's actually a really pretty color. It's showing out a little bit washed out, but it is a really pretty color. Okay, so every month it's the same color. It's a really nice, like, I don't know, blush pink maybe. Okay, and then we have important dates in the back, and then a yearly overview of 2020, whereas over here is 2019 yearly view, so that's really cool. So again, that is Bloom Planners. Also included in the swag drop was some stuff from Sweet Kawaii Designs and she actually um, pitched in the Michaels make room last year at Go Wild and now she is in Michaels. So these are some die cuts it looks like. I should have probably opened this but I will say that I'm way more prepared for this year's video than the previous two years swag videos. So I should get some credit for that right? 
Okay, let's see. Some of them are foiled. Pretty foil at that. What was that? Is that bacon? Taser, is that bacon? Uh, because we were on the panel, we actually got a chance to talk. And she's super sweet and super pretty. And how cute is her stuff, y'all? This is boba. This stuff is adorable. Got some, is that a waffle? A taco? This stuff is super cute. I'm loving it. Like McDonald's. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I'm really loving it. This stuff is super cute. I've never shopped from her. But um, I think I do have like one of her notepads that I bought from Michaels. Because I thought it was super adorable. Um, Simply Gilded. These are some foil glittery llamas. And then she also gave out these little 5mm washies. Um, unfortunately, the glare is just going to kill it for us all. <laughs> but um, they're cute. And I want to say, because I saw someone take a picture. Let's see. Yes. They match, y'all. They flippin' match. I don't own any 5mm, but since they match, maybe I'll keep them. We'll see. We'll see. And then, what is that? Oh, also, hopefully I didn't forget any of the panel swag. But, your girl donated some swag too. That's right. Your girl. Me. Keisha. Um, I donated two different colors. That's so pretty. I love it. Um, I wanted to do a lot of different boxes. I promise I'm not going to rant about this or rave about this for a long time. But I wanted to do different boxes. And I wanted to do square checklists. Because I do have square checklists in the shop. And I also have heart checklists. Um, and icons. And it's super cute. Um, it's pink and orange. Well, hot pink and orange. And then the other one was like a lime green. And like a bright teal or so. So that is what was on the panel drop. Next, I think I will go into my shop table swag if I can muster it all up at once. So I sat at a Wildford Planners table. Um, it was a great table, but most of all, I had a great view. I'd be more concerned with the view over what's at the table. Um, because I was on the panel and on the social team, I needed to go in early for different things. So I was able to pick my seat and I picked the Wild for Planner seat really quick. I'm going to take a drink and then I'm going to show you all this. Well, let me show you before I take a drink. How about that? So um, I went to the Shop Summit. It was, um, I think there was like 100 to 120 tickets at the Shop Summit, which started the day before Go Wild. And it was nothing but like business owners or people who want to be business owners or like um, bloggers. Just anyone who wanted to do anything business related. It was hosted by Office Depot, so we got some goodies there, which I may go through. I don't think it was a lot of stuff, but y'all, this cup. This was at the Shop Summit. I'm trying to hold it right so I don't waste it. And this cup is nice. It's like double insulated, I guess. But y'all, let me show you this lid really quick before I waste it. Oh, there's got, it's got water on it. How unprofessional of me. Because I've been drinking out of it all day. Alright, so let's talk about this lid. And I'm going to do an Instagram story on this because I just noticed this today, right? Okay, so it comes with a straw that is slightly bent already. I'm sorry, it's wet. Um, so that's the straw hole, right? Or you can close it up completely if you want, right? But I lost, well, the straw is somewhere in one of my suitcases. And I was like, damn it, what can I do? So I started moving it around and it's a drinking hole. So there's like, this this is an amazing lid, Office Depot. I don't know who picked this out, but this lid is amazing. I'm, I'm going to try to get some more information on this cup. <laughs> so I can see. Let's see, is there something on the bottom here? No, it just says do not microwave. It has an X on it. It almost looks like the Zyron logo. I don't know. I'll get to the bottom of it. But y'all, this cup. So this is sitting on the table at the Shop Summit. Okay. Let's, let's go back in. I just went on like a total lovable thing. So, um, at my Wild for Planners table that I sat at. This was just, I thought this was adorable. This was just extra decoration. I thought this was really cute. Um, Villa Beautiful Pen Loops. This is a Villa Beautiful Pen with Go Wild on it. I'm kind of glad I didn't buy the pen now because, boom, here it is. Hopefully, I can, okay, I guess I can zoom in a little bit more. Maybe it'll focus in. It's a piece of glitter there. Um, but I'm not sure. I know they were talking about a pen of hers not being released yet for go while i'm really not sure honestly um or maybe it was released and they were talking about a different pen but i love it 
so those two were from Villa Beautiful. Let's see what else. Okay, there was a pin from Villa Beautiful. And since we're talking about pins, I guess I'll go. I guess I'll go through my pins that were on my lanyard. I didn't get a chance to put all of them on there, and I only wanted to put Go Wild related ones. So some that are related to Go Wild, or some that were given to me at Go Wild. So this is the pin that we got. It's by Beula Villa Beautiful again. Planner in the Wild. This one was actually um, included in some flowers that Wild for Planner sent me back in November. It was such a great gift, but um, yeah, this was included in that. This one is actually my pin that I sold this year for Go Wild merch. Um, let's see, these two were given to me last year at Go Wild, I think. If not, at least this one was given to me in 2017 Go Wild. This one was given to me um, in a pack of like llama related pins this year this gorgeous um i'm so sorry if you watched one of my vlogs and you saw me mostly go through these i apologize um this one is the shop owner's name is venus and her shop is a treasured home she did a ton of cute um 3d printed things like cookie cutters with the wow logo so cute um these were from previous years. It says Keep Austin Wild. It's an EC pin. And I do think she gave us another pin this year, but I didn't put it on. Oh, what was I thinking? I was missing out on so many good pins. This is Planner Girl Chatter. I got it last year. Llama Love. This one was given out by admins. I think only the admins and some volunteers had them, and they were just giving them out when they felt it necessary. And this Go Wild Las Vegas pin was... Um, on sale actually I missed the merchandise last year so I'm like I'm getting it this year so this one was on sale so while I'm at it I'll just show you um, what else was sold um, there was the washi bundle and then there was the pin I just showed you and so this was the washi bundle and it was designed by Irene I do believe so this one just has the wow logo in multiple different colors of blue and pink this one was definitely designed by Irene for sure it is gold with like a, I want to say a turquoise or like a deep teal. I know those colors are so different. And it's multicolored too, but it's also in the Go Wild colors. So it's foil and super cute. So that was, you could buy them separately, but I got them in a bundle for $20 maybe. Alright, so back to the Wild for Planners table that I've like gone all the way around the world to try to talk about. Um, Let's see everything's kind of okay so we got some elvis inspired glasses y'all how cute is that and then we also got an elvis wig literally i have the proof we got an elvis wig like <laughs> and then we also got something that is too big to show you on camera can you guess what it is we got a cape we got a full flipping cape y'all <laughs> um I want to say that maybe both of the wild I don't know how many tables there were for wild for planners but I know there are 140 total but I think wild for planners did two to four tables I'm not sure and I'm not sure where all of them were located so the tables were nice and I felt like it was perfect it was a perfect place for me to sit because there wasn't I don't know like I love shop stuff but we honestly get so many samplers and then I'm like like if I sit at too good of a table I'm like oh no like Simply Gilded table I could have sat there but I was like no I love Simply Gilded washi I have a bunch of it but I just feel like there's somebody else who truly 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 loves Simply Gilded and like they would just truly fangirl the table and it would just like make their life to sit there so I didn't want to sit there like why should I sit there when I can like literally make someone's life, you know? <laughs> so, um, it was great sitting at Wild for Planners table. It really was. Um, also, I don't have this to show you because I'm not entirely sure where it is. But there was a $100 Vita gift card there, y'all. Yes. So, the table just rocked. I love the decorations. It was a great seat. The hats and the cape. And it was so nice, y'all. And I'm probably missing something. I am missing something. If I find anything else, it'll be in this video or the later video, but we also got a notebook, an Erin Condren notebook, and you know what, I feel like we maybe got something else that was Erin Condren that was also like Go Wild related, I'm not sure, but we got the notebook, and there was a sticker sheet inside, I hope this was inside, and it wasn't in the EC swag, but either way, it came from Go Wild, <laughs> so 
just a go out sheet and yep just a college ruled notebook i don't have one of ec's notebooks yet so that was pretty cool so that is mainly what i got at the table if i got more i'm sorry but it was a great table y'all okay moving on i wonder how long this video is gonna be i'm going to like you know not show every single thing in this one and do a second one just because i don't want to edit an hour long video and you don't want to watch one right well hopefully well i know some people do love hour long videos but i don't want to edit that shit i'm going to now go through the happy planner swag um well part one of the happy planner swag which since i'm talking about it i probably will go through the other happy planner swag so this is the swag bag so much happy wow it looks really massive on the, on the camera. I guess I'll show you that last. So, we got three journals. Be nice, work hard, and be brave. This one's blank. I had to make sure it wasn't dot grid. This one is dot grid for sure. Women in... Okay. So, I have, I've seen this quote. I have this quote on several different things at this point. And I had all weekend on every video, it said... I thought that it said women empower women but it says women support women so i'm sorry <laughs> kind women are the future of womankind i love that so we also got some pens from happy planner and as you can see one is missing it is my favorite pen of all the pens so i actually took it off so i could put it on my lanyard and it's in one of my bags and i absolutely cannot find it and it's just driving me bonkers so <laughs> it's a little i don't know if i already said this just now but it's a rainbow pen and it says radiate positivity or something like that and i just love that pen so much so when i find it well we may talk about it if i find it but in the process of looking for that pen i did find this pen from birds fly studios this was in the hallway um in the middle of a break it doesn't want to focus properly um yeah this is callie from birds fly studios she has a hummingbird on her shirt and um i actually asked her um because i knew she was doing like a special sponsorship I asked her um, what it was so she could help me with bingo. So one of the no-go bingos, which if you don't know, bingo is a game that the no-goers play in PTW. Um, I make the board, so I asked her um, what she was donating. So one of the bingo spots was um, hummingbird on a pin or something. So that was really, you know, it was cool. Because people were like, what? <laughs> and it's always funny because they're always like, what? not realizing that i know i know all the things so this is the card that came with the swag and this is what the pin looked like radiate positivity it's talking about two new collections that are coming to the shop um planners and then like a lifestyle collection which there's cups hats shirts mugs all types of cute stuff that's a coupon there oh gotta hurry up and use that so yeah and then we got this cup that i'm going to go ahead and get out of the package as you find I ended up getting quite a few cups y'all <laughs> so it says sisters girls gals women babes mamas and llamas that's right you see that inclusive llamas down there I love it love it so so much um yeah it's black so that's pretty neat there's actually something in there talking about the lifestyle brand that was launched and speaking of launches um, about 30 of us were chosen to go to the Happy Planner launch party, and I thought it was so awesome. Um, I have the vlog footage. Go watch it. Um, this was on, it should be vlog number, no, let's see. By the time you watch it, this vlog will be up. It was on Saturday, so this would be vlog number four. Yes. So, go check it out if you want to see what all was going on, but it was nice. There were snacks, and, um, there was a lot of mingling. It was just great, um. So, let's discuss what I got from there. So, I got this really nice tote. It is a happy tote. You won't be able to see the full thing, unfortunately. Um, if I may, you know what? Just go watch the vlog, y'all. I talk about everything again in that vlog. So, I'm going to quickly, very quickly, go through this in case you've already watched the vlog. Oh, I just noticed this. Um, the Villa Beautiful pin we got, they actually gave us an uh, ink refill, so I thought that was cool, too. Alright, so, in this bag, again, if you want to see the full 
back go watch that vlog so this mug that we got it says creativity is contagious pass it on that's a quote by albert einstein the inside is blue how cute is that and um again this everything i'm about to show you is a part of the happy planner lifestyle um i want to call it a brand but it's not um the new lifestyle launch let's just call it that so this is the mug that we got there and then we got a bunch of shirts and I thought we were only going to get one shirt and I would have to pick the shirt. That wasn't the case. And there's actually a shirt that's missing. I ended up giving it to a friend's mom who was trying to get one at Planjama and the one that she caught was actually in her daughter's size. Okay, let's try to zoom out as best as we can. Alright, it would probably be beneficial if I took some of these out of the wrapping, but just deal with me here, okay? This one says happy on it. This one says the same thing as the cup. It's I think it's just in different colors. So it says the same thing as the cup. Wait a minute. This does say... Okay, now this one I have to take out because I am I really am unsure if it says women in power or women support women. Okay, it says women support women. I think I've been reading it upside down this whole time. But it's such a pretty blue, y'all. Oh, let's just completely undo it, shall we? And this is a nice shirt. It's like thin, but it feels like it'll really fit your body pretty well. Women support women. That's really nice. I just like threw that one the all hail. This one is what was on the swag bag. So much happy. Let's see. Okay, this one. I'll just go ahead and rip this one open. Live creatively. And what happened was when we, um like signed up to see if we were picked it looks kind of bluish but that's the light i promise you it's jet black there we go um right when we signed up to see if we would be picked to go to the launch party um we had to give our shirt size so they had um you know like a tote full of everything in like a medium bag or a large bag or whatever so that was really nice and also we got a hat which matches this shirt oh boy this hat is so dirty oh my gosh i have I don't even know. I've been wearing this hat so much since I got it, okay? Look at this hat. So, all of this is a part of the brand, and you can pick it up um, at Happy Planner. And then this one is my favorite. If we had to pick one, I was going to pick this one. It says, spread some happy. Now, I'm not going to go on another tangent about how much I really identify with Stephanie Fleming in her session. Just watch the vlogs, and you can see me cry and all that good stuff. So, <laughs> this is actually a short sleeve sweater it's kind of loose it's nice you know like it's it's loose but it's still a sweater but it's short sleeve and it's great it says spread some happy today and I just love that because I've been trying to spread my happiness if I have this newfound happiness I've been trying to spread it with the world and oh, I'm not gonna do this because then I'll start crying so just watch the vlogs y'all <laughs> I can probably turn this uh brightness back up now okay and I think let me check the bag and see if that's all the happy planner stuff and yes it is so on top of all that we got this really good quality tote so that was pretty cool okay y'all i think that i'm going to go ahead and end this video here in the next video we'll talk more about corporate sponsors and um that type of jam so i will talk to you in the next video thank you so much for watching i would really love it if you shared this video with a friend who may want to see the swag um comment tell me what was your favorite thing that i showed or what was your favorite things that i showed because i would love to know that my favorite thing um was definitely that happy planner sweater that i showed you and then um the akatar die cut from the prancing doxy those are my favorite things so comment share the video if you know someone who would like it or i don't know like post it to a planner group or um share it on your facebook feed or screenshot it and post it on instagram just help your girl out please <laughs> and um thumbs up the vid this video subscribe if you would like to go check out those vlogs i mentioned everything will be in the description box this is enough talking so i will talk to y'all in the next video okay bye